Mendel's experiments. Mendel used a number of contrasting visible characters of garden peas. Round or wrinkled seeds, tall or short plants, white or violet flowers and so on. He took pea plants with different characteristics. A tall plant and a short plant produced progeny from them and calculated the percentages of tall and short progeny. In the first place, there were no halfway characteristics in this first generation or F1 progeny, no medium height plants. All plants were tall. This meant that only one of the parental traits was seen, not some mixture of the two. So, the next question was, were the tall plants in the F1 generation exactly the same as the tall plants of the parent generation? Mendelian experiments test this by getting both the parental plants and these F1 tall plants to reproduce by self-pollination. The progeny of the parental plants are, of course, all tall. However, the second generation or F2 progeny of the F1 tall plants are not all tall. Instead, one quarter of them are short. This indicates that both the tallness and shortness traits are inherited in the F1 plants, but only the tallness trait was expressed. Thus, two copies of the traits are inherited in each sexually reproducing organism. These two may be identical or may be different depending on the parentage. A pattern of inheritance can be worked out with this assumption as shown here.